The Livid DS1 is a versatile control surface for your DAW, with plenty of knobs, faders, and buttons to act as a project mixer and creative instrument. The layout is reminiscent of a standard small mixer found in any studio. However, instead of audio controls, these will control your music software. Out of the box, the DS1 is set up for easy mapping to your software. You can use your software's MIDI Learn to map controls to the functions you want for EQ, compression, levels, and even plugins. With the online editor, you modify the settings and colors so it works exactly how you want it to, changing the MIDI messages, channel, colors, and so on. For example, you can change the buttons to act as toggles instead of momentary, and even change the colors of the on and off states for each button. If you are using Ableton Live, Bitwig Studio, Logic Pro 10, or Native Instruments Tractor, you can use our integration scripts to make mixing incredibly creative and productive. In Live and Bitwig, the organizing principle is extremely simple. The sliders map to track volume, and the knobs map to the first five macros in the first device of the track. The active track can be selected with the top right encoder, and the other three encoders extend the active track with three more macro controls. These four knobs are designed to map to macros on master channel effects, so you can dial in any final compression or EQ. This makes it incredibly easy to put controls on each track that can best shape each track for your mix. We've prepared a few presets for EQ, compression, and effects that you can drag into a track to make it easy to get started. I want to be able to fine tune the EQ on this track, so I'll grab the DS1 channel EQ, which puts four bands of EQ gain on my main knobs, a pan control, and gives me band sweep on the encoders, so I can dial in my EQ exactly how I want it. In these audio tracks, I've used the DS1 channel tailor, which combines EQ with a sidechain compressor so I can get these guitar layers to interact and blend, but still remain unique. These instrument tracks have customized macro groups that give me control over the sounds of the synths so I can control their character. On the drum track, I can control EQ levels, as well as saturator, that gives the drum some bite and compression. I also have a gain control so I can use the full length of the slider as needed. So, you can see, you can make your mixing environment as standard or as customized as you desire, depending on what you want to do with your tracks. The 3x3 buttons are used for transport and recording controls. Play, Stop, Global Record are on top. I can select scenes with these two buttons and launch a scene with the center button. This is great for when you are sketching out different ideas with clips or using the DS1 as a DJ mixer in live. The overdub and automation enable buttons make it easy to add automation or record more audio or MIDI to clips. Finally, the bottom right button will change the mode of the channel buttons, from solo mute, to launch and stop clips, finally to arm and track select. Because Logic Pro 10 is structured differently than Bitwig and Live, the control service plugin that we provide is more fixed, like a traditional project mixer. The top three pots are set up for channel EQ, and the bottom two are sand, one, and pan, respectively. The encoders are used as parametric EQs for the selected channel. The top encoder buttons are used to select tracks, and the other two offer count-in and metronome controls for easy session recording. The pots are used for the return channel 1 smart knobs and levels, so you can, for example, adjust your reverb levels and sound. The track channel buttons are used for mute and record enable for each track. The 3x3 is used for transport control to make it easy to punch in and out and set loop points for creating overdubs and do multiple takes. If you're using Native Instruments Tractor, our mapping shapeshifts the DS1 into an incredible 4-deck controller with effects, 
EQ, and filters for each deck all at your fingertips. The buttons are reconfigurable for different modes, optimized for playing tracks, switching cues, looping, and playing remix decks. Your software can do anything, and so should your mixer. Livid DS1. Find out more at lividinstruments.com.